right. Okay. So, football, baseball, basketball, that's what you think of maybe when you think of sports. Mm -hmm. But there are other activities out there that we may not label a sport. Okay. So the question becomes. Well, in a new segment, we're doing this question. It's, it's called, is it a sport? So our, Bro right, our Brody Logan um, and photojournalist Chip Bazin met up with a group in Virginia taking hockey to a whole new level. I'm ready to go. Underwater what? Underwater what? Underwater hockey what? Yes. Underwater hockey. It's hockey underwater. Pretty simple, right? Most people think it's hockey sticks, like you're out of the water or there's ice involved somehow. But actually, none of that is involved. Underwater hockey involves six-person teams wearing snorkels, masks, and fins, wielding a 12-inch stick, trying to push a weighted puck down the bottom of the pool toward a goal, all while holding their breath. You got all that? It's, it's a lot different from a lot of sports because you can't breathe when you want to. So you can't have one person just, just take over. It's different than anything else you probably experience. Basically, it's like a shark feeding frenzy. That might be an understatement. At times, underwater hockey is pure chaos. And at times... It's like a beautiful waltz. You can't talk to your teammates underwater, so nonverbal communication is key. Tapping on the bottom to get other players' attention, or using your hand to make a loud noise with a stick, or just shoving people on the surface to get them to go where you want them to. Just like ice hockey, underwater hockey can get a bit rough. It does get really physical. I have seven stitches. Kicked in the face a lot. Goose egg. I've got a few pucks to the face. Headshots. I've had a few black eyes. Actually broke his eye socket. In spite of the injuries and the shortness of breath, Capital Region Underwater Hockey is dedicated to pool puck. If it's your strong corner, to now become the strong side back. They practice three nights a week. Black team, Will, Chris, Brody, and Kristen. And spend their vacation time traveling to events, some as far away as the World Championships in Hungary. So, is underwater hockey a sport? Once you try it, you'll understand. It's one of the most physically exhausting things I've ever done, but even when there was a chance to touch the puck or maybe score, I'd want to hold my breath just that much longer. So is underwater hockey a sport? I'd say yes. In Fairfax, Brody Logan, Fox 5 Sports. Say it's a sport, I guess. right? I would not fare so well at that. No. No. Not either. Um, let's check in with Kevin Ray. Hey, it's Fox Big Time. I just want to know how Chip filmed everything underwater. It was really cool how it he did that. Cool. I'm sure it was a GoPro, but it looked really cool. Yeah. Anyway.